Welcome back to Friday's Good Day Sun Law. Joining us now is Jacob Whitkop. He's here to talk about the upcoming Red River Chorale concert. Jacob, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Absolutely. All right, so y'all have a concert coming up very we soon. Do. So yes. um, let's talk about the theme for that concert or the, the title. Sure. Right, and so the entire season has sort of had an overarching theme uh, about the choral legacy and the music that has endured and continues to inspire for centuries upon centuries. And uh, this concert in particular is focusing on something really unique. It's about enduring psalms. And so the, the uh, Old Testament, the biblical psalms, the texts have inspired um, composers and poets and uh, artists for centuries, millennia, in fact. And so uh, we're doing a couple of those mainstays. It's also a masterwork concert, which uh, it's been a while since we've sung an extended uh, piece of music uh, with that group in particular. So, uh, and I'm, I'm happy to announce that we are performing uh, Bernstein's Chichester Psalms in conjunction with uh, um, another modern piece, the Dorchester Canticles, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, a couple other English, uh, actually in English, uh, kind of representations too and so it's multi-language multi-century uh, in fact and it's wonderful it's just fantastic music okay so that's the red river corral mm -hmm. enduring psalms when and where is this taking place sure so just down the street from the studio at emmanuel baptist and uh, performance is next thursday at 7 30 p.m and i would also like to plug uh, that we are able to uh, offer free admission to students this time around okay. and so um you know, and, and that includes that includes uh, K through 12, and you know, uh, young as well as older students. Um, just let the person know at the at the door, and um, you know, kind of check in so we can kind of help document that. And actually, um, uh, part of that was made made possible. And I apologize if I didn't memorize this. Uh, <laughs> we do have a grant I'd like to acknowledge and thank, supported by a grant from the Louisiana Division of the Arts, Office of Cultural Development, Department of Culture, Recreation, and Tourism in cooperation with Louisiana Arts Council uh, as administered by the RAC. Funding has also been provided by the National Endowment of the Arts. Wow, okay, yeah. so that was made possible by this grant. Yeah, uh, we provide part of the funding, but definitely we're, we're more than uh, thankful for some external support through grant to make this possible. It's, uh, it's quite a big undertaking and I'm, I'm just, I'm more than happy to just, just have people come and, and see this masterwork music performed in central Louisiana. Okay, so mm -hmm. for anyone that's never been to a Red River Chorale concert, mm -hmm. what can they expect? Sure, well, you know, the term choir can mean any number of things, especially mm -hmm. in the 21st century. Uh, we do gear a little bit more toward the traditional side, and this one in particular, it is a, it is a more, uh, for lack of a better word, kind of classical mm -hmm. sort of paradigm, and so, um, but uh, we do it artistically, and, and I think beautifully, and so, um, yeah, it's a, it's a traditional choral venue, and then, as I said, this is featuring some music that perhaps isn't performed at most choir concerts, so a really unique opportunity. Okay, and so we saw, I saw that tickets are $15, mm -hmm. um, so how can people get those? Sure, so we do have social media and we do have a website, and you can purchase them through those avenues, or you can do tickets at the door. Um, you know, it, some folks like to be cautious and just know ahead of time so right. that they RSVP and, and have their tickets in advance. I think that's fantastic. <laughs> uh, and of course, if you're if you're a student, you know, you can check in at the door as well. Okay, so. that's right. That's Thursday, March 16th at 7.30 p.m., right? Yes. And that's at Emanuel Baptist mm -hmm. Church, which is actually right here in downtown Alexandria. Right. All right. Well, Jacob, thank you so much for joining us this morning and letting us know about this. Absolutely. Well, we've got more to come here on Good Day Sun Law. Stay tuned.